In today's episode, we're taking this box that we made for airsoft guns and turn it into a uh, utility crate for the back of the Jeep. Let's see how it goes. So my plan is to take this older air compressor tank, or not air compressor tank, but this old air tank that I have that I'm gonna start using for airing up when we go off-roading this gas can that I repainted and made it look better. Ideally, I want that to sit in there on all that, mainly sit more like flush with it, have the air tank there, and maybe some room for some tools in the middle. And then I also have an older military ammo crate box that we're gonna try to see. I just wanna clean up the back of the Jeep to avoid we open it up here having this issue of amongst tools it's from the old off-roading trip but that will that first crate will sit perfectly from there to there with a little bit of room i can tie it down and then ratchet straps and things and then i cleans it up so i don't have this mess back here so so far since we had it set up for airsoft guns we had a bunch of just Needless crates, uh, holes back there. So I gotta make sure, I gotta measure some things, but I gotta make that fit in there. Cut out mostly this middle one. I might cut like this handle width from like there that way. Clean up that, keeping this most top of this intact. I can. This is gonna be a different story because I know part of it with this back section right here will probably hang out. So what I'll have to do is I'll cut the top of the door. This part of the swings down here I'll have to cut that to make that fit in there and then I'll have to cut the back of this in such a manner that it's still tight fitting to this but so that I can put bungee cords from like that side to that side to hold this in or from put hooks on this to ride strap or to hook that up to that handle right there and then maybe put a bag of tools like in this general area. I don't think I have one that will fit up there, but that can be like for some sh or a small shovel or an ax or something for some other stuff. And then I'll dig out that other one and maybe make that one for the bags. But so far, I gotta clean this up. I actually probably won't do that. I think I'll do that. I'll just start removing the shelves to clean that up to get area to put these in to test it. section cut out on the top one now I just got the same thing down here it's gonna be a little bit tar harder because I want to cut close to the same on that um, but for the most part that turned out a lot better than I thought except for right here at the end I can't get it with the saw so it leaves this gross little end right there but I gotta bang these out focus I gotta bang these out right here three of them and then clean it up and then gotta do it on this one and then the, the air tank should fit in perfectly and I just gotta figure out how I'm gonna cut this door that top one and this one for the gas can or the jerry can and see where it goes from there <laughs> of the wheel has it pushed a little too far out on this end so the wheel won't fit but 
I have a plan for that. And yeah, but mainly this is a rough idea. Basically what the back will look like. And then I have another military box that will probably fit right in here. That should work. Um, I might also be able to start laying down my back seat. Romeo, let me go off roading. I have another person, so I leave the back seat open because uh, I have two other people with me. But if I don't, then that works perfectly, so I have that. But basically, that means that I can have this rope or this air hose and have it. Um, a get the knot out of it. Get the knot out of it. There we go. Have it come a decent ways back. I mean, I'm holding that, and I'm pretty far back, and that will allow that to work. And then have the gas tank right here, which will make that look better. And I can even have because I just have bags of tools just in case. I can have those sitting like that and just be more out of the way. And then jack stand, I'm gonna need to get a high lift for up top on the roof just because I'm tired of having a jack. But gotta figure out the spare, gotta figure out the rest of this. But for right now, I'm going to chalk this up as a win because it's in, it fits. And I don't have to have a gas can in here. Um, so I can still use the shelf space. But I'll continue doing this and start playing with stuff. But mainly got this in. It's all done. Um, I'll probably keep going with the video to figure out that side. But nice to get the hose to fill it. It's pretty long, so I never have to leave it out of the vehicle if I want to leave this box in. I don't take it out of the Jeep, which helps a lot. But for right now, I'm going to go into this video. Well, the other video and then put it up. But like I said, all we got to do now is put this in and we're done.